Hey there creators, Maeve here with a sewing and embroidery video. This week I'll be creating armrest covers. To go over the armrests on my tattered computer chair. I made some of these many months ago for my husband's computer chair and now I need some for my chair. Alright, let's get started. What I'm going to be making is some pads to go over my armrests on my computer chair. And I made some for my husband a while back and they worked out great and they look great and they're pretty fun and cool. So now the armrests on my computer chair are starting to get uh, worn out as well. So I figured I would do the same thing for me. So what I did was use a piece of freezer paper. I traced the shape of the armrest and then what I what I did was I added about I placed these over the fabric that I was going to use and I added about two inches all the way around and that way it gave um, this is the part that'll rest on the top and it'll curve underneath. So here's the finished products. All right, these are reversible. One side is the print, and the other side, if I flip this all the way around, is the embroideries that we did. All right, look at that. All right, so how they go on, and you can see my tattered chair here. How they go on is you put it over one end right here, and you bring it all the way to the end, loop that the other way, and then adjust it like that. So there you go. And then we have them over on the other side as well. And then from there you can adjust them. And then there you go. Now if I wanted to reverse them, all I have to do is pull them forward, take them off, flip them around. Mm -hmm. 
There's this image, which is all sewing type knickknacks. And there we go. All right, look at that. My name's Nev, and on this channel I make arts and crafts videos. On Sundays I post kid craft videos with my kids. Sometimes that's school projects we're working on, and sometimes it's art lessons using palettful packs, which is an art subscription box. And sometimes it's just other crafty kid things. On Fridays I post my own arts and crafts videos, and that can include speed paints of original artwork that I've done, or colorings from adult coloring books. And sometimes I do other crafts like sewing or machine embroidery. If you like what you see and you want to see more, go ahead and click that subscribe button. And if you want to get notifications on when I post, click that little bell icon too. And if you'd like to support my channel, maybe get access to some exclusive content, check out my Patreon and consider becoming a member. Thanks so much for watching and have a really great day.